So I'm Dr. Andrea Lowe, a Senior Consultant and Head of the Department of Rheumatology and Immunology at SGH. So more than just aches and pains um, that affect the aging population, a lot of rheumatological conditions are complex autoimmune diseases and very few people know about them. In fact, it's one in ten people uh, may get these conditions and potentially life-threatening and can affect many organs. So one of the purpose of the SWIM is to raise public awareness of these conditions so that people can come forth um, to have their, diagnose, uh, their conditions diagnosed earlier and have timely treatment. Another um, way we help patients is through innovative research and this SWIM is really to raise funds as well to support research in rheumatology. So do come and support us and come and take the plunge with us. CEO Prof Kenneth Quack, myself and together with the senior management team will be making a big splash this year and we hope to raise even more funds um, than last year and we're going to have an even greater public awareness effort with fun and games, um, patients sharing their stories as well as um, doctors and the allied health dietitian uh, giving some helpful tips to our patients. So we hope to see you there. I believe all patients have uh, their own stories and I actually always learn from all the patients from all the different aspects and the things that actually struck me at the beginning of my medical education was when I was doing rheumatology elective um, as a medical student. I, I saw a patient with lupus, she was very young, she was a model before, she looks very good um, but then after she was diagnosed with lupus, she, she was treated with steroids and subsequently um, other, other types of immunosuppressants and despite all these treatments the patient still ended up in um, end stage renal failure requiring dialysis um, so she was very very depressed and um, it actually made me think how as a doctor I could help the patients um, of course by working very hard, studying very hard to, to give the best possible medical treatment for the patients but on top of that I learned that there are a lot of limitations to the medical treatment for which there is a very, I mean everybody should actually do research to improve the treatment, to improve the patient's outcome. They can take part in many different ways. Mm -hmm. uh, if they can swim, it is good for them to participate in swimming. I mean it's not only good for their own health but it is good to swim for a good cause which mm -hmm. in this case is actually to help the patients and they can also support by hygiene a fund for uh, whoever is swimming and number three they can also come and support the event uh, they, we will have uh, many different programs to actually um, help the public members the, the society to have a better understanding about rheumatological diseases they can learn from the patients usually we we'll also have interview with the patients we'll share their experiences their challenges uh, undergoing all the treatments and having the disease as well um, and there will be doctors, specialists, uh, nurses there to also help the society to learn better what the patients are going through 